we'll see. It, you know, I wouldn't be surprised to see if the snake doesn't work that we do something else. Yeah. Lucina probably. Yeah. Yeah, Lucina Wolf is a really interesting matchup. It feels like Wolf may struggle with sorties. You know, it's really early in the meta, so yeah. it's hard to determine a lot of these kinds of things. And since K9 has been in SoCal, we don't really have you have a few snakes, but he hasn't. I don't know if he's played any of them. Yeah, have, Johnny, yeah, BMC, Johnny Westside. Key. Yeah, we have J West, Key, BMC, other snake like AC, you. Armando. We have AC. So he hasn't been able to play them as often in bracket, but we'll see how Kana can do for it. Immediately starting off by showing respect, saying, you know what? I know what your game plan is. I'm going to stick back, use these lasers, and wait for a follow up here. And immediately gets the jab. Yeah, and the lasers on top of that will pop the balloons and the grenade. So exactly. if Salem just wants to start from tossing grenades at him, those are going to get intercepted midair most of the time. All right, man. Both these guys taking their time, respecting each other's options. Salem off to a pretty early lead, though. But we've seen the damage output that Wolf has. Yeah. That back air, yeah. that down smash, man, until it's so early. And immediately, Kana using those jumps to get around the grenades. Tries to go for the neutral, and Salem with the punish okay. from the parry. Okay. We got those. There's that grenade in the back air again. That's just going to net Salem so much percent the disadvantage and but see, take the advantage himself. Exactly. And it's also Salem's job to understand what's Wolf's options when he's coming above me. And he knows that Kana was going to go for the neutral air. And neutral air. Normally, a very, very oppressive tool. Yeah. But Snake has so many ways to kind of shut the neutral air down. He, exactly. has, a, he has a lot of kind of extended hitboxes, I'll say. I wouldn't call them disjoints necessarily. I mean, Snake is a very tall man. Yes, <laughs> he's a big guy. All right, well, can I a little bit away from that C4? Trying to get something against Salem. One for the cross up with the back air. Two of them not able to find much Salem skill with a lot of advantage. And there's a the setup, and he gets a dash wow. attack afterwards. And then up E going to trade with the grenade. K9 taking advantage right off the bat, though. Weak back air. There's the up tilt. Yet again, K9, what are you going to do? He's got to find a way in on the snake. Nice, using the neutral air to go for a dash attack immediately. Salem's been doing tremendous work against K9, and K9's been having a tough time just trying to reach the Salem. He's got him at kill percent, but he hasn't been able to find an opportunity. Salem with no follow up from the C4. But so far, it does allow Salem to go for an edge guard, and he tries to set up something with the Nikita. Oh my goodness, the grenade. Okay, there's something weird about Wolf's reflector where, like, the underside doesn't reflect it. It's because, yeah, so it's because the way that the reflector works, yeah. it's very similar to Guardian Orbitars from Pit and Dark Pit. Yeah. It's actually, yeah, the underside doesn't actually reflect. So the grenade explodes underneath and pops him up into the up smash. And, and the way that Salem had set himself up at the ledge, right, he sets up the up smash, right, with a napalm. He had two grenades, enough to cover the spacing yeah. from the getup, from the roll. Salem had that cover up so well, and so far, K9. Kind of like, you know, shaking his head, he knows, okay, man, I got covered up the game. Let's go ahead and keep my head in the game and yeah. go on to the next game. He's, he's got to figure out something. I mean, he can't just play the same way that he was. And, you know, what that might be, only K9 knows, really. Exactly. All right, another interesting thing about the laser with the, the uh, grenades is that because it's, the grenade has a hitbox on it, or a hurtbox rather, it will stop the laser. Exactly. Yeah, whereas, you know, like a fox laser would go through other things, like a Toon Link bomb. Right? Exactly. There's that back here, it nearly oh. sailed. There's another one. Can I in a bit of trouble? That side B, he's got to be careful when he goes back. The side B does not auto snap the ledge. Yes. But it does have really good horizontal grip, so K9 exactly. definitely gonna be looking to take advantage of that. All right, K9 kind of staying on the stage. He knows Salem might have been going for that C4 play, but unfortunately missing that up smash. Salem with another up tilt. That up tilt really going into overtime would work. It's kind of interesting to see how Salem plays Snake because he was a Brawl ZSS main, right. and with Brawl ZSS you had those items. So this is kind of reminiscent. I've, this is why I'm kind of like I like the way that Salem playing the Snake. Yeah. He has the items to toss out and use them for coverage. I'm sure he misses his roll cancel item throws, though. Yeah. 
And of course, that's that castles and such. Yeah, the football punch. Yeah. Alright, Karen, still in a bit of trouble. 72%, he's got Salem with even stocks, but the percents are in Salem's favor. Trying to do some pressure with that forward air. Yeah, it was really well spaced. If he had come in a little bit more, he might have hit the grenade and then he would have gotten punished for it. Chase, and now the option. He yeah. sees the percent because he knows what percent are going to be able to work for. And he's at low enough percent where he can say, sure, get up and attack me, that's fine. Yeah. If you don't, I'm going to get something. So close to getting hit by the C4. But K9 pushing towards Salem here. He's got 72% if you can get another option. And Wolf, I mean, he doesn't have the best edge guarding options, but he has really good options to catch landings and that's where Snake struggles quite a bit. Exactly. And that down smash gonna bring it up to even stocks. K9, he's gotta get off the ledge. It's one forward air, but able to reset neutral. I like it, using, using the blast here. He's able to explode both of the bombs. He's not gonna fall for Salem's setup here. And he tries to go for a back air, but immediately see him using the down air to get out of it. I like it, down throw. Looking for the back yeah. air again, but he's not able to find it. But I like the fact that he's still going for it, because he almost saw the option sought out. Yeah, he's searching for the double jump, but Salem could have just air dodged through, and now he's kind of got him in the corner. K9's got to find a way back. That up tilt's so scary. Up tilt may not kill right now, but now it definitely will. There's an Akita! Okay, still living. Still, still living, but he's got to survive, and I like oh, it. Oh, no. It's the angle. It yeah. was the angle, man. Yeah. He had the right play, but it was the angle. He had angled it a little bit more towards the 45 degree angle rather than that 30 degree angle. He would have even, even if he had done that, it's very possible that Salem would have been able to sneak enough tilt in before he dropped yeah. the ledge. So who knows? Either way, man. might have been the option as well. Yeah, either way, man. Salem. 2 0 up on K9. The man who put him in loser's bracket. Genesis. He's getting the run back. He's getting the run back. And the snake is doing it. Well, so far, look at the way that Cannon's adjusting himself in the seat. So he's looking to possibly get himself back in the game. He's up. He's down to low against Salem, so we'll see how things can go. Right off the bat, K9 just kind of coming up on top of a lot of these trades. You now these guys are going tit for tat. Oh! And it just feels like K9 is perpetually in disadvantage. Up till not yet. Very soon though. Nice, using a double jump to land him with the air. Kind of changing it up. So far, Salem so content with how that up tilt has been putting in mileage for him. But now K9 is starting to pay a little bit more respect to it. He knows what he wants. Oh my goodness. Salem expecting a cross up there. Not able to get the punish. Oh my goodness. Oh. Once again, Salem is just all over his options out of shield and in disadvantage. That Nikita gonna snipe out that first stock in this game three. Yeah, you can tell K9 definitely wanted the cross up on that back end, but it's Salem got the better end of that deal. Alright, Salem going off the deep end. K9 looking for the edge card here, but he's not able to find it. Comes, I like the fact that he still saw the C4 there. Gotta show oh no, he dropped right out of the Cypher at the perfect time to where it had a hitbox. And for those of you wondering, Cypher, Cypher only has an 8% threshold. So if you have a move stronger that does 8%, you are able to go through it. Oh, and Salem able to land on stage and even get a dash attack for his troubles. There. There. Okay. Salem is doing a great job. He's covering his tracks. He's leaving breadcrumbs. Yeah. It's like Hansel Follow and me. Follow me to yeah. the doom. And that's what I'm talking about, right? This is going back to how he played in Brawl. Yeah. The assessment, the, the items that he's able to put into play, the setups that he has. For if the breadcrumbs are on the trail, it's Kanan's job to start seeing through them and find the option to call them out. He gets the up smash, two stocks, but Kanan's still behind. 
Yeah, man, he's got a lot of work to do. Salem's just kind of, I don't know, he's just shutting him down. Yeah. It feels like K9 hasn't really been able to get anything started. I haven't seen a forward air combo in a long time. Yeah. Let's just say that. Okay, K9 showing a lot of respect here. At this point, he has to be careful around Salem, but he immediately oh. opens up with that upper into the back air, puts him up the platform. Down throw. Expecting a get up attack that time. I mean, yeah. he hadn't done it up to that point, so I'm sure that's a decent mix up, but up tilt once again. Salem will 3 0 K9. Yeah, Salem gets the run back from Genesis 6. Yeah. And Pretty again, we were talking about how Leffen and Salem were fated to meet one step closer to that. Yeah. They are one step closer, man. The story, the story is.